all, and welcome back to my little corner of the internet. For today's video, I'm in the kitchen recipe testing with y'all. I'm going to be trying out a jackfruit brisket recipe. And I'm excited about this recipe because it comes with a special announcement. So I've been invited to work a booth selling vegan brisket sandwiches at Eeyore's birthday here in Austin by a nonprofit organization. And I'll have a little more about that organization when we get to the end of this video. But for now, come along and experiment with me in the kitchen. So the first thing I'm gonna make is the sauce for the jackfruit brisket. And then I'm gonna set that aside to marinate while I make a quick, easy slaw. These are the only two components that I'm gonna recipe test today. So I hope you'll stay tuned to the end of the video to find out about the organization I'm working with. And we'll go ahead and get started. I've got one onion and three cloves of garlic, water sauteing. I'm gonna measure out the rest of the ingredients so they're ready to just throw in there once the onions are caramelized. So in this bowl, I have measured out the brown sugar, maple syrup, apple cider vinegar, water, red wine, Worcestershire, paprika, salt, and pepper. That's my dryer. I'm gonna take care of that. I have a can of fire roasted crushed tomatoes and then my can of jackfruit. I'm gonna set these aside, add them to my pot once my onions are caramelized, and I'm just gonna make sure the jackfruit is cut up to a nice little bite size. We've got our bowl of jackfruit that I'm going to set aside to pour the marinade over later. While those onions are caramelizing, I'm going to chop up the vegetables for the slaw. For the real thing, I'm gonna do purple and green cabbage and carrots, but for just the test, I got purple cabbage and I've still got the carrots in there, just to make a smaller batch. So now in here I've got purple cabbage, there will be green cabbage for the real thing, apple cider vinegar, maple syrup, mayo, salt and pepper, and carrots. So this is what the onions look like. They're all they're all caramely. Now I'm going to add the rest of the marinade ingredients to this pot and I'm gonna cook it over a medium heat until it comes to a simmer. So this has been simmering for about 10 minutes. I'm gonna pour it over the jackfruit now.
All right, I'm gonna let this cool a minute and then I'm gonna put a lid on it and I'm gonna put it in the fridge for a while until I'm ready to cook it. This is the red wine that's in that marinade. It's really sweet, I like it. And that's it for my recipe testing today. Recap, after cooking up the jackfruit, we concluded it was a little too sweet and could use a little kick. So I'm going to try adding two teaspoons of red pepper flakes and taking out the brown sugar. I will also be blending the marinade for easy brushing when I cook this on the grill. If you wanna get this full recipe after it's been tweaked, you'll have to sign up for my recipe email list. I have a link down below and I'll be sending that recipe out shortly after your birthday. But for now, I'm gonna hop over to my conversation with the leader of the organization that I am working with. I'm here with Carol Hernandez, founder of Foundation Foundation. And what does your organization do? Our organization uh, promotes health and wellness through fun, fellowship, and fitness. We raise money for uh, students to pro uh, provide scholarships for students to go to college or high school or physical activities. We help provide funding for students to participate in extracurricular activities or to uh, pay for tuition for school. That's awesome. And how can people support you? People can either attend our events, they're always promoted on our Facebook page. You can participate by donating at our website at funnation.org, or you can attend all of our events. And I'll have that link to their Facebook down below. Is there anything else you want to say? Nope, I look forward to seeing y'all. And thank y'all for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell to get notified when I post new videos. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. And sign up for that recipe email list. All the links are down below. I hope y'all enjoyed playing around with me in the kitchen today. I'm Vegan Rainbow. I'll see y'all next time. Bye, y'all.